Hello everybody and welcome back to Horizon Forbidden West where I checked the map because I'm like, oh, 3,000, that's pretty far away. We are absolutely not do doing this quest right now. I thought we'd already gotten, uh, this was, oh, this is like the central capital, I guess. This is the low, like that we haven't <coughs> actually been to like the lowland, lowland capital. What? Moonfish skin. That's where the moonfishes are. Oh, that's right. I have those. I have some of those selected. Perfect. Excellent. Let me see really quick. I think I saw a work table in here. <laughs> oh, I don't know why I'm having a hard time. Uh, there's a major Overwatch League game going on, but I'm letting it go forward a bit so I can fast forward through all the downtime. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I want to... <coughs> Excuse me. I'm so sorry. I want to upgrade I want my potions. My resource pouch? Or did I... No, okay, I can't do that. Okay. Trap pouch! Trap! Oh my gosh, I gotta go kill some of my children! For your mother, children. Africa, I don't even know. I don't even know on those. Don't care. Don't care, don't care, don't care. I don't know what we're doing, though. <laughs> I don't know why I'm running. I do actually want to do this one. It's not too far, either, it looks like. I am gonna have to run through unknown. <laughs> I mean, I could cheat, but I don't want to cheat. I want to run through here and see what's here. Oh yeah, the Ostrom Runaway. But we don't even know if she's. They didn't say if she was Ostrom or not. I'm tempted. <sighs> Go grab the ding neck tall neck too. Re I was like, what is that? <laughs> Head out! Whirled around by the wind. It's just right there. Right. That tall neck looks damaged. Yeah, they're gonna. Take a I'm look. at least gonna look at it. I don't know if I'm gonna actually do anything with it. Because the problem is that, uh, for whatever reason, they decided to make it really difficult to do tall necks in this version of the game. Pigeon. I don't think I have anything. <laughs> I do not think I have anything that requires a pigeon. This looks like Osram gear. What are they doing here? Are they still here? Did they try to damage the tall neck? Oh my gosh, the Osram. I should check it out. If they tried to damage the tall neck, they kind of deserve whatever happened to them. So they were hunting something else. The tall legs are invincible, though. Except for this one apparently is damaged, so that's something. They were hunting something else. My friend said that he bought, or he picked up a lot of these that he didn't really use, because he didn't really use food either, but he would sell them for, like, one coinage each, you know? And I'm like, maybe that's, because he has, like, 30k Ouch. or something. I'm sweating everywhere. It's ridiculous. He's got so much money. Wanted me to investigate. Attached to ballista. I don't want to damage a a tall neck either. Oh hey, here we go. We got something here. I should try and find out what the awesome were doing. Yeah, I know I am. There's a there's a little note <laughs> pad back here. Why am I dying? Oh, a book. Steal to my soul. I do love their saying. Steal to my soul. Fortune favors the bull. We found ourselves one of the- No! See? This is- You deserve what happened to you. We found ourselves one of them. Tongue they served upon a platter all alone in this big, white, empty desert. Runda's anchor slings are too sluggish to catch them. Smaller machines with this dull, hammered fellow moves nice and slow. If today's test run goes well, we'll strip him for all he's got and skedaddle back to the claim with more salaries than we can sell. You don't touch tall legs or you're not supposed to- You're not- I thought that was like a, a basic rule. Here. I should take a closer look at that. There's a, there's a basic rule of like wandering the desert. I need to highlight that? I don't. I mean, I can see it right here. It looks like it's just going in a teeny tiny circle, too. Oh, I didn't. I hadn't scanned a tall neck yet? That's funny. 
so an override might fix the tunnel. Oh. But how to get up to it? Apparently now it has weak spots. Oh, there's maybe some. Oh, that's the ballista over there. I didn't see anything besides the corpse over here. Oh, fire? Let me look at this. Or is it just... Oh my goodness, I almost lit myself on fire. Wait, what? This thing shoots bankers? They were trying to take down that tonic. Machines must have caught them in the act. I wish there was a way to climb up and inspect the damage. Unless I take the tall neck down myself. Try to repair it on the ground. What? It won't be pretty, but at least it'll get fixed. What? You want me to knock the thing over and then repair it? We will oh and weigh it down. I was like, you can't what? Hello to you too. What? Oh geez. Oh geez. Oh hi. Machines got to this one too. Um, um, I don't have enough points to do what I want. Yeah. Um. That was all I had. I realize I'm hurting myself with my own frost. Anyway, I'm just gonna do more damage to it. Like, I feel, you know? Like, I feel like I'm going to do more damage than good to the tall neck if I knock it down. Or slow it down, or whatever it is I'm supposed to be doing. have to hook an anchor to the weak spots in its armor to weigh it down. Oh, okay, that's what I'm doing. Okay. Let's see. Can I mark it? No. So basically at the hinges. At the joints. These things are big, like if they fall down, like they're gonna do more damage just by being down there. We could climb up on it and fix it. But no, we gotta knock it down, make things harder. Oop, nope, not that. This is the smallest tall neck, um. Oh, shoot. Bloody parchment. Gandalf is dead. I killed some of the machines with the anchors, but they slashed me good. If anyone finds this, whatever you do, do not, for spark's sake, no matter how much your steel-headed brain tells you to, mess with the dang scorched-out tall neck. You've been warned. Yeah, well, yeah. I thought that was self-explanatory. Like, people would have taken down the tall necks by now, all of them, if, if it was easy to do, you know what I'm saying? What if there's like some spooky shapes in the distance? But oh, that sounds terrible. But I need more anchors. The Althra must have set up other ballistas in the area. Oh! I just gotta find them. Okay. I am gonna be, yeah. There's probably other anchors set up in the air. Yeah, well, also there's we freaking them. Use them to take down that tall little neck. new machines that have decided to come over because they sense something. Shoot, an acid bellow back. Perfect, actually. 
I don't have, oh my gosh, machine muscle, that's wild. They move so, like, gracefully. It's really cool. Hurry up, my guy! That's not fair. I bet a ballista can help me fight these machines. Yeah, well, or we could just do what we usually do. I knew I should have used my Valor Surge. Not this, not the one I have equipped, but the other one. I thought two Purge Water traps might do it, but because it's weak to Purge Water, but it was not enough. I should have used my my special Valor Surge for that. Looks like those guys are over there, which I'm like, that's fine, but it might not actually be fine. That might be where the other ballistas are. Looks like they took a machine down. Yeah, we've already them. been here. Oh, could I examine? Hang on. These are tall neck antennas. Ah. Uh, the officer must have. I didn't see those highlighted. Probably with those harpoons. I was looking around for highlights. Another ballista, and it's got one of the anchors I need. The knee joint. I think I can hit that one. I need to try to hit its butt. Or that one again, maybe? Jeez. One more should weigh it down enough. Spawned enemies. Oh, ah, dang it. Oh, hang on. What am I doing? Oh, they're just gonna fly away. Oh, they're gonna chill over there. That's probably where another ballista is. Yeah. Great. Great. There's, there's probably one over here. Yeah, I think I see one. Oh, rebel outpost? Where? Ah, oh, I okay, it's so far away. Crunchy scorpion obtained. Nice. I was actually trying to kill a bird. One of those big old birds. Let's use... What did you do to me? I don't know what this... This, this symbol is. Oh my gosh, they pulled in another one. Look how spooky that looks from far away. The way that's like eyes are on the side of its head. That's so scary. It looks more heavily armored. I wonder if it's like an apex, no? Okay. Looks like the only one on this side's on that back joint. On the leg. What happens if I don't, like, get them all? They're, like, Ayla, where's Ayla gonna pull an anchor out of her, like, back pocket? Like... Oh, I could do one up there, it looks like. Good. 
Here comes trouble. Did I get it? confused about why it's running away. I set up this kill zone and everything. <sighs> Alright, little friend. Big friend. Just climb. This is what I was gonna do. I wasn't gonna like try to fix its legs. I could have just tried to climb up it like I usually do. This was excessive. I'm glad it could also somehow get up uh, without me, me needing to take off of take off its the bonds that were keeping it tied down. But. Skills. Let's see, we have enough skill points to get this one and see how it goes. I can make friends! Woo! I was working down the infiltrator line too when I... Weren't I? I am just leveling up so fast. I do feel maybe if I reach max level, I'll just I'll actually turn it up to hard just to make it more difficult when I'm fighting things cuz I don't necessarily like things to be too easy. All right, well. Now I feel like that took too long. <laughs> I've been recording for 30 minutes. That can't be the whole episode, right? Right. Let's Oh, we've cleared the area. That's right, that's right. That's why we did this whole thing, so we can see a little better. That's good. Now I'm gonna run, and hopefully get past the slither fang. And all these other things. Bye, friend. Take care of yourself. There are some interesting... Oh shoot, what happened to you guys? There are some interesting looking structures off in the distance. Rebels. I heard they were in the area. The best way to get rid of them is to take out their leader. Yeah, well it didn't work out so well for us last time, unfortunately. Hooked it. Nice. That worked out exactly how I wanted it to. Oh, you can't see me up here. Don't pretend you can see me. You got a Ravager hiding in there. Oh shoot, there's a big behemoth convoy just right there. Oh boy. Going in Viz. The Outlander's back. <gasps> I, I saw something. Too. Okay, good timing. That rebel's got some heavy gear. They must be in charge. Oh jeez, it ran right into me. Oh. Okay, so some of them are running into them, which is nice. What is this? This is a big city. Holy cow. Got a 
machine locked up below the tower. If I blow up the blaze and fix it, check for tags. These look like tags of some kind. Must be the ones Duke mentioned. I should take them back to the grove when I get a chance. Without a leader, the rebels should abandon this place. But I could always deal with them now. Either way, I'm done here. There are blaze canisters. Wow, you got up here. Too late to retreat now. Oh my, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. It was brutal. Come on, use the ballista. Ow, ow, I won't let me use it while I'm being fired upon. Oh, I should use. much better okay I've lost her shall we go back concentrate your fire yeah good luck <laughs> that's a little bit of easy mode I guess uh, what I thought the behemoth was gonna get involved in this fight, but I thought it was gonna get involved against the other people. I can keep going. Where? Who's firing at me? Oh my gosh, you're way over there. I can't even see you in this sandstorm. These rebels won't be bothering anyone else. Woo! I love that ability. Listen, Behemoth, this doesn't involve you. If you could've if you could have gotten involved earlier, that would have been great. The Ravager, I think, is still below me. Need to get my fire arrows back. Oh, that's not what I wanted to do. I was actually really hoping that that would just blow, blow it up. Uh, but that was not to be. And I don't have, I don't have nothing. Okay, what are you weak to? Acid? I got that. to hopefully finally use this can I not oh my Much gosh better. why can't I use it there we go that does very little cool beans What? You can do it too? No wonder it didn't take much damage. Now I need more. Come back here, you coward. No, you started this fight. 
Actually, I did, but you're still. I'm still gonna. I'm gonna defeat you. Whew! Got a purple from it though. What is that? Oh, jeez. Hey, what happens if I go into it? This must be the ruins of Las Vegas. Oh, the ruins of Las Vegas. Oh, is that the dang nab Las Vegas Tower thing? I just saw that the other day, or a couple weeks ago. I don't know. I drove through Vegas. Didn't I? No, where did I go? No, I was in St. Louis. What am I talking about? I wasn't in Vegas. I have seen... This year I have driven through Vegas a couple times when I was living in California for a bit. So I have seen it, that, that dang nab Las Vegas Tower thing that I can't think of. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call this one here. I apologize if it's uh, just kind of short and not interesting. I, I like to get the rebel bases done as I go, if I can. Uh, but, because I just don't want to have to do them all at the very end, you know? But, I know it can be a bit tedious to watch. I, I enjoy taking down the machines, and I do enjoy taking down the rebels. But I enjoy taking them down less now that um, my... My usual method of trap shenanigans isn't, isn't allowed. Having the ballistas around was nice, though. I'll be, I'll be, I'll be, I'll be honest. <laughs> Shoot. Was this the- oh yeah, that was the Ravager cannon that I knocked off. I forgot I did that. That would have been nice to use. For the- against the Ravager. It, di it didn't come off till the very end, though. I feel like I'm doing okay with, like, elemental exploits and stuff like that. Um. But... I'm sure I can always be better. I'm sure there's, like, really optimal things. The thing is, though, is, like, I don't think there's, like, one optimal path for success in this particular game, which is nice. There's just so many options. Like, I really want to use the, the thrower, like, the spike thrower more, and I'd really love to use, um, like, the gauntlets and stuff, but those just, they just take ages. <laughs> and the spike thrower takes up so many resources. That's the big problem with the spike thrower. I use the spike thrower all the time. Give me a freaking javelin hucker any day, but but yeah, I don't wanna um, I don't wanna use up, like, I think it uses up blast pace like a, like a like a beast, <laughs> and so I don't wanna use it too much I probably should've changed my armor too I'm just not, like, it was easier in the first game where you like, oh, I'm fighting this element I will put on this armor and now I'm like uh, like, for the most part, I'm trying to stay long distance, and then when they get up close, I forget to change my armor into something more melee. It's okay, though. I'm cooking um, my armor in this heat. Listen, we're wearing Tanakh desert armor. You're not cooking in this armor. You're cooking your skin in this armor is what you're doing. Oh, thank you all so much for joining me. I will go ahead and call this one here. But yes, really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially Rescalito, my sapling tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. And an extra special shout out to my tree tier patrons. Christopher, thank you so, so much for your support. You're the super bestest, and I appreciate it a lot. And an extra, also special shout out to Adam, my other tree tier patron. You guys are the bomb, legitimately, and I'm really hoping that maybe with Patreon, the Patreon, um, support i can get either like a like a like a knockoff gopro so that i can like do videos of where i've been which would be fun to upload for you guys or get a better elgato so i can record just better videos in general because this one's fine but it'd be nice to be able to do the 1080p 60 frames per second which this one can't do it's an older elgato that i've had for like seven years now i think and it's just it's going strong but be nice to maybe get a better quality one. So thank you all so much for pre supporting me. And if nothing else, like legitimately, you know, that is some of those, some of that stuff that helps me out just regardless. Like even if I'm not buying stuff for the channel, like it helps me get hotel rooms and stuff when I need them. So I really appreciate it. But thank you all so much for your support. I appreciate it. And I hope to see you the next one.